Hello guys, welcome to YouTube. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn how to make capture image with PHP. So we have this capture folder inside our development directory. So we need to open this and we need to open git g git bash so that we can use the php command to open our local host so going to type php then s minus s and you can use local host and then 3030 and press enter and you will see that listening on http localhost this one so we need to copy this link and here we can type this and paste and go you can see we have this login page and there is a capture code here you can see if i reload it if i reload this image it's reloading here and we can type our password and username and then I'm typing wrong password so this one and trying to log in so you can see that invalid capture please go back and log in again and if I go to this login page again load it admin and typing the password and typing 6 K P J O B and hit enter. You can see please wait logging in. So our capture code is working and today we are going to demonstrate it here. So you can have this project files that is auth login for processing the login uh, credentials. There is a captcha.php which is which creates the captcha uh, image. There is a font file you can download it from fonts uh, .google.com and you can download any fonts you like and there is an index page for login page and there is a php info to see if uh, there is a php info file you don't need this just for uh, demonstration demonstration purpose i have used this so you can see the php info here the php uh, PHP version uh, that is 5.6.38 but right now the latest version is 7 point something and you can see all the configuration here and so let's create the capture image first so you need to have a text editor for this I'm going to use sublime text so let's start with this at first we need to open sublime text okay we have this sublime text and now we are going to open captcha.php so we need to open the captcha.php file we have this empty captcha.php file here so we need to type the tag php tag and then we need to start the session and here we are going to create a string that is a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o So far we have created a string which is combination of a, b, c, d, a to z uh, which is small letter and capital letters and also uh, numbers. Then we are going to make a string that is uh, sorry captcha so random string is going to be string shuffle. We are going to use the string shuffle. Uh, then we are using 
string and then we are going to make a captcha code uh, we are going to use the six digit captcha code so we need to make a substring, uh, substring uh, function which will use the random string and the starting will be 0 you can use 2 to uh, 8 for the 6 digit or you can use 0 to 6 for 6 digit and we can echo out this capture code so uh, on our browser we need to type the capture.php so you can see 1hkzti you can also use this uh, captcha as, as a captcha for text based but we don't need the text based captcha we need image based captcha right so you can use this captcha code to, image the, uh, to create the image so at first we need to uh, create some variables here that is uh, font is going to be our font.ttf file and then the font size we are going to use that will be 20 pixel and the font uh, image width is going to be 135 image height is going to be 35 and there will be another thing that is image is going to be image it that will be image width and the image height now we need to create a background uh, background color for the image that will be image color allocate that will be image red should be for the background that is white blue and that is our white and another color text color image color is going to be image color allocate dollar image that should be zero zero and zero for black color the function that is image tf text you can see those uh, parameters we are going to use the image should be this one the size is going to be font size angle should be 0 and x and y coordination of the uh, text to the image and the color of the image that is going to be image color font file is going to be font and text is going to be capture code so let's write these parameters that is size or font size and angle 0 and x position should be 15 and y position should be 20 color we are going to use image color font file font and then text is going to be our captcha code and now we are going to use a header that is content type image jpeg or you can use png format and now image jpeg and the image is our parameter and if i refresh the page here that you can see the capture image so we need to uh, change the parameter uh, the top position uh, to 25 i think it should work Uh, 25 and we are going to use the height uh, 40 ok so we need to use 25 to the, uh, that is going to be 30 I think should work ok you can see the capture image is loading you can see here now we need to place this capture code and you can see we have the started the session here and we have used the session that is uh, we're going to use the session capture we need to put this 
uh, capture code to the session that is capture code and we are going to assign this session as capture code now we have initiated this capture code we will store this variable to the session variable ok now we have this so far and we are going to use this capture.php file so we need to go to the index page here you can see we have this username uh, field called password field and there is a place where we can put the capture image so we need to go to our index.php file here you can see we have this uh, reload uh, anchor tag and we are going to use the image tag and source should be capture.php and we are going to use the capture code for the alternative uh, tag uh, attribute name that is this one and you can see there is a link which which uh, what it does is it uh, calls the function refresh capture on click refresh capture so, so the function is very simple we are going to use the capture image which is uh, we are going to copy and the id of this image is going to be capture image so we are going to call this capture image at the, uh, by the id and the source we are going to use the capture.php and random equal to true or we are going to use random equal to method random and capped.htr source is going to be this source so let's refresh it and if I reload, you can see it reloads the page. Now, we have this uh, page and we have authentication login. You can see here that is, if it's a dollar post login, we can uh, tie, uh, we can use this one here. We, we have initiated the session here and we're going to uh, see that if uh, we need to uh, see the printer dollar session for the debug printer dollar post and if I go to admin and the password 9khdv6 and hit enter you can see we have the capture code which is our session variable and the array is going to be username admin password this password capture text is going to be this one so you can see this thing and this thing is similar and login is going to be login so now what we going to need is we don't need it right now so we need to comment it out here if is set dollar post login and not empty dollar post login then what we'll do is uh, we'll need to create two variables that is uh, in capture text is going to be dollar post uh, that is going to be capture text here we need to paste it and dollar capture code is going to be dollar post capture code now we need to use the if statement here that is if not empty dollar uh, capture code and string case map we are going to, to compare the string case that is uh, string one would be dollar capture code and string two should be capture text ok now we have this thing here and if uh, 
this string escape uh, function returns which is not equal to zero then we will sh uh, show echo that is login failed capture code mismatch or we can use invalid login fail this one please go back and re login exit else echo um logging in dot 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 then exit for the demonstration purpose uh, i use this uh, echo you can use the redirect method uh, you can use uh, the header method to redirect the user to the index page for the successful uh, uh, captcha validation or you can use the header uh, function to redirect the user to the index page uh, so you can use this thing so let's see here if i reload this page uh, sorry undefined index capture code uh, capture code is undefined oh this should be our session variable i mistaken it so reload it so you can see logging in okay so if i reload it and use admin password and you can see here if i type is 0 4 uh, g z n all of this is small letter and if i log in in login fail capture code uh, so i think i made some mistakes here that is when i'm typing when i was typing uh password r six p a o p i reload it again okay g s l t z i all i have typed is small letters so it will it should work logging in and if i made some mistake with the captcha k one 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 one, one and login you can see login fail capture code invalid please go back and re-log so you can see that we have made this capture image validation with php in our next uh, tutorial we are going to use the math capture uh, with the subtraction or uh, we can use uh, the addition method so thanks for watching this tutorial, hope you will like this, please subscribe my channel for the upcoming videos, thanks for watching.